In the heart of Southeast Asia's rainforest roams a legend, a powerful and elusive predator known as the Malayan tiger. With its stunning coat and fierce roar, this subspecies of tiger, scientifically named Panthera tigris jacksoni, is a symbol of strength and mystery. The Malayan tiger is one of six surviving tiger subspecies, recognized only in 2004 as distinct from the Indochinese tiger. Malayan tigers thrive in the lowland forests, mangroves, and mountainous regions of Malaysia, where dense vegetation provides perfect cover for ambush hunting. Yet, their territory has dramatically shrunk. Once spanning most of Southeast Asia, today, their range is limited to fragmented patches in Malaysia, with a few reported in southern Thailand. Weighing between 220 to 300 pounds and stretching up to 8 feet in length, it is slightly smaller than its Bengal and Siberian relatives, but no less formidable. With a lifespan of 10 to 15 years in the wild, these predators are designed for stealth and power. Their distinctive roar can travel up to two miles, a warning to rivals and a call to potential <laughs> But behind this powerful presence lies a story of survival and struggle. Unlike most cats, these tigers are powerful swimmers, often seen crossing rivers in search of prey. Their stripes are unique, much like human fingerprints. No two tigers have the same pattern. These tigers require vast territories, with males controlling areas of up to 100 square kilometers to find sufficient prey. Deforestation and human encroachment have made survival a daily battle, forcing tigers into closer contact with villages and roads. A master of stealth, the Malayan tiger relies on its powerful limbs and keen senses to stalk prey. Their diet consists mainly of deer, wild boar, and smaller mammals. Their hunting technique is a deadly combination of silence and speed, stalking within striking distance before a sudden burst of power. But with shrinking habitats, finding enough food has become increasingly difficult. As prey numbers dwindle, tigers often wander into plantations in search of easier meals, leading to dangerous encounters with humans. Malayan tiger cubs are born blind and vulnerable, usually in litters of two to four. For the first few months, a mother's entire focus is on feeding and protecting them. By the age of two years, young tigers must leave their mother to establish territories of their own. A perilous journey fraught with challenges from rivals and the ever encroaching human footprint. Today, fewer than 150 Malayan tigers remain in the wild. Poaching for their skin and body parts, combined with rapid deforestation for agriculture, has pushed them to the brink. The demand for traditional medicines and exotic pets has made the Malayan tiger a prime target for illegal hunting. Habitat loss is another deadly threat. As forests are cleared for palm oil and rubber plantations, the tiger's range shrinks further, isolating populations and making breeding difficult. Without enough genetic diversity, these isolated groups face the risk of inbreeding and disease. Amidst the crisis, conservationists and local communities are fighting back. The Malayan Tiger Conservation Program has ramped up efforts with anti-poaching patrols, protected areas, and captive breeding initiatives. Sanctuaries and zoos, like those in Oklahoma and Malaysia, play a vital role in educating the public and ensuring a safety net for these magnificent predators.